All right, guys. So the uh, build is coming on the Uzi SL. It's the new frame you saw in the last videos. Slightly different front end on it now. I've got some kind of cross country forks on it, which are a lot better. Not getting in the way of things at all. It's lovely. And then we've had a delivery. Oh yeah, from the US of A. Lightning rods in the house. Look at that little beauty. 1500 watt mid drive continuous rating, 3 to 4 kilowatt peak. I've had a temperature sensor put in the motor just in case. <laughs> Here's your motor. Mounts on with a bracket round the back of your bottom bracket here. This is just a circular bracket. And you BB goes straight through it. There's your motor. There's the output. Onto a toothed belt. Onto a plastic gear with a freewheel in it. Then travels, drive travels across the shaft and out the other side onto a go kart chain. The old cat chain drive then goes down to the main crank and the main crank drives the rear wheel as normal allowing you to keep all your bicycle gears your quick shifters and the ability to keep sipping at the battery when you want to climb hills instead of drawing loads of amps to pull up you can just knock it up a gear lightning rods small block small block kit there's lots of room for customization, extension of pant guards and things. It's not mounted at the minute, it's just hung on there tenuously, so I can see what it looks like. That's why there's a tie wrap. When that tie wrap's not there, it's just going to look so good. I think it's going to munch through them test hills. Absolutely munch its way through them. But uh, you know, you'll remember the video, it's up there, so uh, we'll be going back to those exact same hills and I'll get someone else to film me going up and down and we'll see, see how good she really is. So we've got a V3 cycle analyst which is the control panel for the controller. That's here. We've got a throttle. That's here. He didn't send the controller though. Boo. So we have to wait for that. It'll be a couple of weeks till the controller arrives. But that gives me time now to work out what I want to do with my batteries. How my wiring is going to sit. Where I'll mount my cycle analyst. All these other little things. And I can't help but think, man, how good would it be with some BMX wheels in it instead of mountain bike wheels? <laughs> yes. So, it's coming on. It is coming on. You really can't get the scale of this motor through video. It's uh, such a shame. I'll flip it round and give you a view of the other side. And the chain will just come off, go around the derailleur, and the motor will be driving here, like this. You see the free wheel, these don't move. Or I can pedal along, or it'll drive, or I can pedal with it. There's going to be plenty of chain noise, plenty of whirring and belts, and oh, it's going to be awesome. It's going to be awesome. There she is, Intense Uzi SL EV. Nice one guys, it's getting exciting now, we're making some ground. Till next time.